The West Highland Way is a long distance trail in Scotland. It's 96 miles long, running from Mulgai north of Glasgow to Fort William in the Scottish Highlands. The path uses many ancient roads and is usually walked south to north by up to 40,000 people each year. Many hikers take on the entire route, taking seven to eight days, while others aim to do it in five. So in May 2022, I decided that I wanted to take on the challenge and solo backpack the entire route in five days or less. And this is how I got on. Get an early start, beat the rain. It's supposed to be raining pretty much the whole day. Oh man, this ain't fun anymore. Check it out! Shows how much rain we've had. On the top of Devil's Staircase and it was savage. It's even more brutal up here. It's properly blowing and it's hammering it down. Yep, day four of the West Highland Way, and I'm just all packed up, leaving the Bridge of Orkey about half past six in the morning. Yep, bit of an early one today, but I just wanted to um, get an early start, beat the rain. It's supposed to be raining pretty much the whole day, so it's just started spitting. I don't know ten past six, so the tent did go away a little bit damp but I wiped most of it off, so it shouldn't be too bad. And um, today, we'll try and crack out another 20, or maybe a little bit more, so. Destination is somewhere around Kinloch Leven, but we'll just um, see how the day goes, so. Catch up with you a little bit later. Wow, well, that's some climb out of the Bridge of Orkey. Oh, not quite at the top yet. It definitely wakes you up.
So sorry about the lack of filming, but that 10 mile stretch was savage. The weather was horrible. Proper windy, raining, I'm sure it was sleeting at one time. So, slight little detour, then Glencoe, and this is the ski centre, which I am going to go and get myself warmed up. A cup of tea and some brekkie. So I'll see you in a bit. So I've had just over an hour at the ski resort, a full cooked breakfast, massive cream bun, <laughs> an apple and four cups of coffee and oh my god, properly needed that, it was lush. So King's House is the next stop, I think it's only a couple of miles away and then Kinglock Leven is about 10 from where I am now. So we'll see how we get on. I'm gonna try and push on if I can. Just really depends how wet I get because the weather's been pretty rough. Um, I think I grumbled about day two and the, um, the hike along Loch Lomond being tough. This isn't that tough. It's just the weather just kills you. It's just freezing, well it's not freezing cold. That's a bit of an exaggeration, it's cold and up on the um, up on the tops it's pretty windy we've just been lashing it down the whole morning it's relentless so i started out in shorts and i have taken them off because they're saturated put the trousers on and i've got my waterproof trousers over the top so i'm all dry and um, nice and toasty in it which is good i'll bring you back in a bit Made it on the top of Devil's Staircase and it was savage. It's even more brutal up here, it's properly blowing and it's hammering it down. Halfway up I felt my knee go, which wasn't good. Grit my teeth and cracked on. Oh man, that was tough. So you get to the stop of Devil staircase and then you got all that descent and that ascent if you can see the footpath in the distance. That's out of order. Oh sorry, can't let's do it. Bandy has made the river crossing submerged. <laughs> that was epic that was. Come oh on man, this ain't fun anymore. Can we have some sunshine back? It was much better yesterday. <laughs> I don't know what you can see of this, but on a clear day, that would look, well, it looks amazing today to be fair. Stunning, check it out.
check it out. Shows how much rain we've had. I do not want to drop the camera in there. Wild. Well, if I hadn't already told you, today has been a properly savage day. Um, Dell staircase and that pass down to Clunt cannot leave them. In this weather, you can hear it. It's been, um, been tough going. Oh man. My feet were killing this morning and then my knee packed in and it was not a pleasant experience. And then it's just been relentless. Raining non-stop since half six this morning. And um, yeah, not very good. So we got the tent, I found a campsite. Got the tent up pretty sharpish. All my wet kit is in the drying room and I'm now gonna have a brew. So folks, nothing else to really show you um, or tell you, apart from it's been a cool day, um, pretty hard though, still raining. I have managed to nip in to have a shower, got dry clothes on and um, pretty much ready for bed to be honest. So it's only about up past eight, but I am cabbaged. So tomorrow is the last stretch, 15 miles, and I've done it. So look forward to that. Anyway, I'll um, sign off. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the morning.